there are so many applications of quantum touch. One of the ones that really surprised me, and this is more recently than many of the others, was I was working with a personal trainer, and he was having me do all these body weight exercises, and he had me doing push-ups. And he was not very impressed with my strength levels or my improvement levels. He had me doing these ultra slow, perfect push-ups, and I couldn't do all that many. So I taught him how to run the energy. And he ran the energy into me, and he said I went from Clark Kent to Superman. <laughs> he had never seen anything like this before. I was actually doing twice as many push-ups in my third set than I did in the first set. Usually people do the first set here, the second one there, and the third one down there. I was actually getting stronger on the second and third set until I did twice as many. Then I said, he worked on all these areas, my chest and my arms, my shoulders. I said, well, I can do a fourth set. He said, well, OK, go ahead. I did a ton of push-ups in the fourth set. And then I said, I can do a fifth set. He said, no one does a fifth set of push-ups. But I was ready. I did as many push-ups in my fifth set, working to the point where my body started shaking a little bit. But the thing that impressed him the most was that my form was perfect in the fifth set as well as the first set. In fact, one of the things that impressed him the most on all the exercise we did was how my form actually got better when he ran the energy into me than it was before. So I went to a, a gym here in town called Gold's Gym. And it's the one Arnold Schwarzenegger trained at. It's uh, known as the Mecca of Body Fitness and uh, bodybuilding, I mean. And you've got these guys in there, the monster arms and everything. And I worked with a trainer there. And he brought a client, and he told me that this guy can do three sets of 25 crunches at this weight, you know, this sit-up kind of exercise on the machine. And I had little pieces of paper stuffed in my pockets because I thought it'd be kind of fun to play this little game with him since I know what happens since I've worked with a number of athletes. He does 25 crunches in his first set. His second set is 50. So I run energy again. And his Next set was 50. And I said, how do you feel? He says, well, I could do another set. So I you know, run energy into him between sets. He does a fourth set of 50. Instead of doing 75 crunches, he ended up doing 175 crunches because his second, third, and fourth set were all 50 crunches. So when he, he said, I've never done this much before. So I reached in a pocket handed a folded piece of paper to the coach, the trainer rather. He opens it up and it says, I've never done this much before. He's like, come on. So then I said, how do you feel now? And he says, I don't feel like I worked out. So I reach another pocket, pull out a piece of paper. I don't feel like I worked out. <laughs> before this had happened, we had done like heavy squats with weights on his shoulders. And after his first set, I ran energy into one thigh, but not the other. And after I was done, I said, how do they feel? He says, well, this side feels really light, and this side is burning like crazy. He said, would you please do the other side? <laughs> Reach in another pocket. Please do the other side. These are predictable. What we're seeing is something that will help athletes recover faster from injury or exercise. Because there's micro tears in the muscles when people work out to failure, and this helps repair them. I went to the University of California, Santa Cruz, and worked on the men's basketball team. And what we saw was an average 10-minute session reduced their pain by a full 50%. Got a nice letter from the coach. They'd never seen anything like this before. When the professional athletes or the serious athletes discover, this is going to give them a competitive advantage like they've never seen or never had before. Now, when you consider the vast spectrum of kinds of problems that people have and the things that they need, what you're going to find is that most people have a lot of emotional challenges in their life. When I would teach workshops, I would ask the class, how many of you had an emotional release during the sessions in this class? And we usually get 60%, 70% of the class raising their hand. The emotions come up and, they, and you can let them go. It feels so wonderful having the emotional release when somebody's running quantum touch into you. I had an experience of this when I was traveling and teaching. 
I had a person in my life who was very important to me. It turned out she had lied about some important matters. I was very upset. I don't know if you've ever felt this way, but I felt like I could be angry for about a week. I was so upset. My friend ran energy into my head. and I'm looking for a good feeling space, but I can't find one. After about 15 minutes, I could imagine there might be such a thing as a good feeling space, but it was very <laughs> far away. It was like on the horizon. Then, all of a sudden, I felt myself diving into the deepest meditation of my life. She had to hold my head up. I, I could have been laying down and been better, but I, was, I decided, okay, I'm just going to go with this. Diving really deep until I was just in this space where, sort of like between dream and, and awake. When I opened my eyes after about 20 minutes, I felt like I was on the positive side of neutral. I had access to humor, gratitude, fun, play, anything I turned my attention to. Well, the very next day, this person comes back, and now the things that she's saying to me are crazy. Not just <laughs> dishonest, but crazy. And I'm even angrier than I was the day before. She, my friend, runs energy into my head again using this very complicated technique we call the where does it hurt technique. <laughs> you put your hands where the problem is and you run the energy there. She ran energy in my head. 20 minutes later, I opened my eyes. I was on the positive side of neutral and I did not have to process those emotions. People have wonderful emotional releases as a result of this work and it's really, really spectacular that way.